Hey guys, I'm Maggie Furlong. I love TV just as much as you do, but I actually get paid to watch it. I'm the showgirl. Dylan McDermott fan in New York City writes, What's your take on Dark Blue? Have you seen any of the new season? TNT's cop drama Dark Blue is kicking off season two soon. I've seen the first few episodes, Dylan fan, and I'm really happy with how they've updated the show. I also talked to your boy Dylan McDermott to get his take, and he couldn't agree more. I feel like this is a, a fresh, new Dark Blue that's a, a little bit lighter, more humorous, and definitely more romantic. Romantic doesn't even begin to describe. New cast member Trisha Helfer is an awesomely sexy addition to the show, and you better believe she steams things up instantly. Need examples? Dylan McDermott was happy to oblige. There was one scene with handcuffs, which I really like, which defined our relationship, where she says to me, she's handcuffing me and making out and stuff, and she was like, I think I lost the key, and I say to her, I hope so. Um, is it hot in here? Everybody raise your glass. Mad Men is almost back. It's one of my favorite shows on TV, and not just because it reminds me it's okay to drink on the job. Cheers. Here to tell us about the new season is the show's best cocktail shaker herself, Kiernan Shipka, also known as Sassy Sally Draper. Woo! Hey, Kiernan! Hey! How's it going? Great. Now, I know you're sworn to secrecy, and I'd never want to get you in trouble with the boss man, but maybe you could take a seat and give us a little tease on season four? Okay. Love it. Mad Men's gonna be great. It's filled with lots and lots of drama, but with a little bit of a comedy twist in there. I really love it, and there's some pretty awesome Sally moments. Unlucky in Love in North Carolina writes, What is Plain Jane all about? Plain Jane is the CW's sweet take on a reality dating makeover show, and fabulous British host Louise Rowe is a delightful fairy godmother for the show's Unlucky in Love contestants. The makeover subjects all nominate themselves for a style revamp in hopes of boosting their confidence. The end goal? Inspiring them to profess their deep love or new crush on a guy who's caught their eye. So what's the one thing stylish Louise thinks every woman should have in her closet? It's not what all the magazines recommend. I think it would be a red dress. Not a little black dress, a little red dress. Because I'm a huge fan of color. I'm a huge fan of being feminine and wearing dresses. I just think it's elegant and feminine. You can dress it up, you can dress it down, add accessories. And the color red, statistically, you're more likely to be chatted up by a guy in. Next week, I'm going to Comic-Con. Check back early to see which of your favorite stars geek out with me at the festival. In the meantime, get your TV fix at tv.aol.com. You can also follow me on Twitter and subscribe to the Showgirl podcast on iTunes. I'm Maggie Furlong, the Showgirl. Oh, and since I had Karen in here, I had to know. What does she watch on TV? I don't really watch a lot of TV. <gasps> what? I mostly listen to music. I really love Muse. I like some Passion Pit. Of course, I like the Beatles and the Rolling Stones. Okay, all is forgiven.